Hey guys, what's going on? It is Summit Snack here from SummitSnack.com and TutorialZip from TutorialZip.com. Today I'm going to teach you guys how to enable or disable the quick launch, uh, quick launch in Windows 7. Now, by default, quick launch is disabled in Windows 7. This will show you how to enable or disable quick launch on the taskbar in Windows 7 as a toolbar with small or large icons. Now, if you don't know what quick launch is, it's basically a, it's used to open a program quickly from a shortcut on the taskbar. Um, in this case, the toolbar from the quick launch folder is located in a hidden in a hidden system folder location, which we'll get to later. Uh, but other than that, let's just get right into the uh, tutorial. So basically, we're going to add the quick launch because there's a lot of customization we can do once we enable the quick launch. So what we do, what we want to do is we want to right click on an empty space in our taskbar and we want to go to toolbars, go to new toolbar. Now right here under folder, you will have, um, basically, I made it easy for you guys. Go in the description box, copy and paste the folder location and just go ahead and press select folder. I have to go ahead and actually select select the folder itself but actually I already have it in my history so I can just do that uh, so right now we just added the quick launch bar right there as you can tell now to expand the quick launch toolbar we have to do this we have to right click and we have to unlock our taskbar so right click and choose lock the taskbar so if you now right click there will be no check mark once we unlock it, you will see dotted lines. Basically, you can drag as far as you want, or as, um, yeah, decrease it if you want. You want to increase it or decrease it, depending on your preferences, whatever you want. I'll just leave it for right there right now. Now, if we want to remove the text and just have icons, as you can see right there, launch Internet Explorer, if I just want the icons, I can simply do this. Right click on Quick Launch, and please note this has to be, your taskbar has to be unlocked. So right click on quick launch and then right here show show text just go ahead and uncheck that and now you just have the icons. If you want to have small or large icons basically right click go to view and go to large icons. I just prefer small for quick launch because the icons on that are way too big. Now if you want to have quick launch on the left hand side like Windows Vista had all you have to do is make sure your taskbar is unlocked drag quick launch as far as you can go and then drag right here by the Windows Explorer uh, to the right hand side. This will um, make it so quick launch is on the left hand side. Go back, lock the taskbar, and now since we added the quick launch on the right left hand side, or basically if we added the quick launch personally, we have to save the theme. So right click on your desktop, go to personalize. Give it a minute to load. And right here where it says save theme, go ahead and save the theme. Name your theme. I already named mine, which is quick launch enabled. Um, once you do that, you can exit out of that. And basically, if you want it now, if you want to remove the quick launch bar, right click on the empty space in your taskbar, go to toolbars and uncheck quick launch. Basically, that's it, guys. And please note if you have 32 bit uh, for Windows 7. It has been reported that you may need to turn off the UAC if Quick Launch is dis disappearing every time you restart. So basically, every time you restart and you see Quick Launch is gone, um, basically you need to disable the UAC to fix that issue. So basically that's it. I'm Summon Snake from SummonSnake.com and TutorialZip.com. Uh, please like this video, comment, uh, subscribe, do all that thing. Thanks for your support, guys. Please let me know if you have any questions. Other than that, I'm Summon Snake from SummonSnake.com, and I'll see you guys later. Adios.